Revolution Golfers, Martin Chuck here, and I'm at the Sun River Resort in beautiful Sun River, Oregon, which is pretty near and dear to me because I lived in Bend, Oregon, just down the road here. And a lot of you suffer from the chipping yips. I hate to say it, but that's the truth. And typically what we see is a lot of bad math. And you go, Martin, what's math got to do with golf other than adding up the scorecard? But here's some bad math. When these elbows are separated and you get a little too close to the ball and you want to hit a little shot, a little chip, and this radius goes bup, 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 and you chunk it or stub it and you get terrified and you can't hit very good shots, okay? So I want you to use an aim stick and understand a few basic things about how to be an effective chipper of the golf ball. The leading edge of the golf club is a tiny little, tiny little margin right there. And what we're going to do, and this aim stick is really tiny as well, I think it's about maybe three-eighths of an inch at most, maybe less, maybe three-sixteenths. So when you aim, put an aim stick down, and I've got a nine iron, I'm hit a little chip here, but I could do this with any golf club. Go ahead and get the club in your hands, get the club off the ground, create good structure in your arms, take that leading edge, and just get used to hitting the edge of that stick and see if you can't get it to glide along the ground a bit. Because if you can get comfortable with that, and I know you can, every student that comes through the academy that has problems with this, we encourage them to chip that stick because it builds confidence. When they realize that they can take that leading edge and hit that little tiny dimension along the ground, doing so to a golf ball with that same intent, good math, get your arms comfortably long in front of you, narrow stance, weight fractionally forward on your lead foot, and in this dimension, you can hit some great shots collecting the ball with a shallow strike. And here's the thing, when you're using the same stick, if I hit one just a little harder, what it does, if you come on up here, you can see that it hit by the first groove there, then it runs up the face, so you know you have a nice square centered strike, and again, that's a confidence builder. So this little shot here, I'll show you one down the line. Aim your aim stick at a target, and then go ahead and get used to hitting that dimension. And then that's gonna leave a nice mark in the middle of the face, and I'll try to get one all the way to the hole this time. Collect that ball with that nice math model to that, to the ground, and then go ahead and roll one out. And I hit that a little too hard, but it was a pure strike revolution golfers. And that's really gonna help you play better golf. Martin Chuck signing off from the beautiful Sun River Resort. You need to come check this place out. Post your questions and comments down below.